Okay, here we are at the farmer's market, the first farmer's market, the kickoff, and we're here with the, the people from Art Haven, a, a select group for now, but they, they're taking over two tents next week. Why don't you guys introduce yourselves? My name is Jason Barrows. And my name is Yen Watanabe. And you? Mercedes McMahon. Mercedes? That's your real name? Or is that your? That is my real name. Your real name. Okay, good. <laughs> Very good. And uh, we're here to, to, you guys are selling art, and you're not, and it's, it's beautiful art. And it's very, very, very reasonably priced. So I want to. So, so, how did you guys come to be part of Art Haven, and what made you decide to take part of this program, where part of the proceeds from your sales is going to a charity? I became part of Art Haven because my school, the Compass Youth Program, actually takes classes there every Friday. And I got an internship for the summer, which was sponsored by my school. And I was introduced to this program by Don and Abby. I picked Action for my nonprofit because they sponsor my school, and I think that they do a lot of good things for the Boston School. Very nice. And how about you? How did you get involved? Well, I've always known David Brooks from when I was like a little girl, so and I've always loved art. So when he came and made, made um, the Art Haven, and I, he just like talk, talked to me about it, and I was like, that's a great idea. So I just like came every Thursdays and Friday, Thursdays and Tuesdays. So and I wanted to cho I chose the Art Haven, the Harvest Meals because um, for the last couple of years I've been going there every Tuesday to help with like create meals for all the people. So I just thought it was a great thing. That, I could do so much for the community. That's a great idea. So so 10 percent. I'm gonna put. Pan down here. 10% of the sales, if people come down and buy your awesome dinosaurs, 10% of the sales is going to go to Harvest Meals. Yep. And Harvest Meals does what? One more time? They, and slowly? They make meals for people in the community every Tuesday from 3 to 6. So, and or actually been, from 5 to 6, but we were there from 3 to 6. And you've been donating your time there as well? Yeah, for the last couple of years. That's fantastic. All right, tell, let's talk about your, your, uh, your dinosaurs. Is, is this, uh, making dinosaurs, has this always been a passion of yours? Is this some kind of thing that you just came up with out of the blue? This happened two years ago when I was trying to find something to give my friends for Christmas, and I wanted to make them something, so <laughs> I figured what better than dinosaurs, and I just came up with this pattern, and ever since then I've just been making them, and um, I thought it'd be a good idea to see if I can make something out of it. Fantastic. So the dinosaurs are 24 dollars each, or two for 40. All right, now Mr. Burrows, <laughs> we're gonna come over here, we're gonna highlight you. You have these beautiful little pieces right here that you could buy in a collection, they're only $6 a piece. And it's very colorful, it would brighten up anybody's kitchen or house. And, uh, and these are really, really cool. You're very talented. Thank you. And how long have you been painting? I have not been painting that long. I've been drawing for a while. And I just recently took up painting as a new hobby. And do you love, is, is it something about the vibrant colors that you're drawn to? Yeah, I like using a lot of bright, crazy colors. That's your style, huh? Yeah, I love it. You definitely have a signature here. Yep. Look at this, this is a beautiful piece. Very cool. All right, guys, I'll wish you all the best. And uh, Dawn, can we talk about a little bit about uh, what you have going on this summer at yeah, Art Haven? Definitely. We got a lot of stuff going on. Um, for the younger kids, we have a young artist workshop, which there's a different theme each week. Um, and so we're starting with Clay Week next week. We'll do a museum week, a week at the Heritage Center, um, stuff like that. That's second through sixth grade. And then we have open studio every day from 1.30 to 3.30 um, for the seventh through twelfth graders and a darkroom photography class. Um, and then we've also got this program going on. And an adult pottery class on Wednesday nights. So. Oh, I didn't know you dealt with adults. Yeah, just adult pottery right now. We might work on some weekend workshops then. But we've Very got some cool. great summer staff um, through the Bruce Anderson grant again. And um, so it's going to be a really fun summer. So check out, you can check out our website, arthaven.org, for more details. Arthaven.org. Or Abby, you got anything to add to that? <laughs> Abby's our new entrepreneurship director. Yeah, I'm working with uh, these awesome, talented artists over here. And just come down and check them out. Talk to them. They're real friendly and they're great at what they do. Cool. Support us. What are the hours at Art Haven? Do you have set hours? Um, well, over the summer, we'll be there from, I'd say, like 9 to 4 every day. Okay. Um, the morning is the younger kids, older kids in the afternoon. So. Fantastic. Thank you, guys.